is a little product called Naxa. It's the multimedia VHS to DVD recorder, but it does so much more than just VHS to DVD. In fact, I don't care if you've got old VHS tapes or you have uh, tapes that are little digital camcorder tapes or cameras uh, or DVDs or USBs or SD cards, you can change them and turn them into the digital format or even, even record digital to digital if you want to and make copies just by using this system. Let me tell you, it's the largest screen that we carry on any of these models. This is a 4.3 inch color LCD preview screen. And this is gonna allow you to do so much for an incredible price. 20 of the recordable uh, DVDs are included with this. It's an all-in-one system that's gonna allow you to take those memories and put them into a more modern format where you can save them Share, Share them. Share them. Uh, do whatever you want with them. Hold them for, for down for posterity because guess what? VHS tapes and those other formats, they're going to disintegrate over time mm -hmm. and you're going to lose all those precious memories. Oh my gosh, don't do that. Don't yeah. wait. This you is a great wanna. opportunity from Naxa. This is the newest, latest, greatest way for you to be able to digitize your family memories. And this is the most versatile digitizer we have ever offered. And here's what I love about it. It's a true standalone solution. So you don't need a computer with this. You don't need a monitor with this. It has the largest screen we've ever seen on on a device like this it's 4.3 inches look at how easy this would be to take to grandma and grandpa's house and here's what you're going to be able to do you will be able to plug into this virtually any device with AV out. So that's yeah. your VCR, that's your DVR, that's your cameras, your camcorders, maybe the old clunky ones you've been hoarding from years past because you don't know how to get that video footage off of there. And you're gonna be able to burn a disc if you want, and we're including 20 discs to be able to do that. That's the disc tray right there. That's where it pops right in. Or if you wanna burn your content right onto a USB drive or onto an SD card, you're gonna be able to do it from this one simple and easy device. Now, Guy mentioned it. We all have VHS tapes, and I'll tell you what, I had boxes and boxes, and I had absolutely no idea what was on them. I didn't want to spend a ton of money getting them digitized, because what if it was just old TV shows, right, that we had been video recording from back in the day? This turned out to be some hidden gems from my oh, husband's yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, childhood. <coughs> I mean, if you wait too long, this is a format, as you said, because this is exposed to air and heat, that cellulose material begins to break down. Don't wait till the last minute on this, because I hate to say it, but the very last VC our manufacturing facility in the entire world has shut down. So I actually had to go to a thrift shop and buy a VCR to plug into my brand new Naxa. But the great thing is you can pick them up really cheap and yeah. then you can digitize all these memories. And what that means to you is you're going to be able to now take that video and now share it with your friends, your family, and the entire world. No one's watching these. No, no one's no. popping these in on a Saturday they night. they fall apart. They're falling apart. And these memories will be lost if you don't yeah. take that step to digitize them very soon. And every one of you probably has these VHS tapes. I, you know, it's so funny, but I've, I've, my original like demo reels, <laughs> unfortunately, sadly, are on uh, VHS tapes. Yeah. Um, and and that's just the way it was. One In fact, right I've here. even got I got some stuff on beta, which you know was kind of before that. <laughs> that was before that. Uh, but but the point is that you know if you've got these memories and they're and they're falling apart on right. you. That's just a tragedy if you don't save them. And this makes it so easy. It's the easiest way for you to be able to do it. And you don't need any special, uh, uh, you know, instructions on how to do it. It's very, very simple when so you get easy. this thing home. And what I love too is the fact that you've got so many different formats by which you can, exactly. you can borrow from. So if it's photo photographs, you can do it from photographs. Photos, sure. If it is something that's on a USB or if it's on an SD card, you can put it onto a DVD. Right. Uh, you can do the opposite. You can go from the DVD and you can put it onto the SD or the USB. You can go VHS to DVD, exactly. um, which honestly, that's that's kind of how the whole thing got started is that in the transition of technology and getting better and better, we all had all these old VHS tapes. And I, I've told you in the past, I've got one I've got one moving image of my dad, and oh it's on and it's on a VHS tape. You don't want that one to. And it was his retirement. I have it, and I have it in my little. I have a little um, an ottoman that's got all these, you know, the, a lot of these tapes in there. Sure, this takes Family a lot memories. of space too. Yeah, I think it's got stuff from like my wedding and things like that. Whatever, we'll figure that stuff out <laughs> later. I don't know if that's ever getting transferred, but anyway, the point is, <laughs> the point is, um, you get to hold on to these memories and you get to pass them along. Well, that's exactly right? it. You know, you have little ones, kids or grandkids. You want to be able to pass on those family memories. Yeah. These are degrading by the second, so. You you need to do something. Now, have you seen those boxes being advertised where you can load up the box and then mail it in oh, the yeah, mail yeah, to yeah, the yeah. company? Yeah. And it's like over $100 for a box. And it hey. takes a few, you know, business. it holds a Good few. business idea. It really is. <laughs> holds a few tapes. Yeah. And then, wait, what if you have more tapes? Then you have to load up another box at over $100. So the 
really scary thing about that to me is I don't want to mail my precious family memories. What if they get lost in the mail? Yeah. Like they're totally irreplaceable. And then what if you accidentally, like I said, I ran across an old episode of Night Court the other day on one of these. Oh, I love that I show. would have been really upset if I had spent money. I love the show too, right. but I didn't want to spend money to digitize it. And then the other thing we hear all the time from these types of devices is that people are using this as a home-based business. So if you kind of check Craigslist or check, you know, the little ad list of what's going on around you and see how much people are charging to digitize tapes, you can actually be doing this for other people. You can be helping family members or even sure. making money while you're in your pajamas. I think that's a great idea. Yeah, because like you said, you can see, you, you go to the, if you've seen the, the newspapers and things like that, there's constantly people that are advertising about how they'll take your tapes and they'll save them for you. You can do this yourself. And it's very, very simple. It's the easy. machine Look at is the menu. very, very compact. It's, a, it's only a little bit bigger than a DVD player. Exactly. Actually smaller than a lot of DVD players, but you, the size of the DVD itself. By the way, you can use this as a DVD player too. You can. I'm going right? to show that in just a moment yeah. because this is a high definition DVD player and burner right. all built into one. So look at this easy to use menu right here. So it just says, what do you want to do? What are you burning from? Are you burning from an outside source? Do you want to go from an SD card to a USB drive or the other way? Or do you want to burn some of this content onto a disc or something that's onto a disc? Do you want to transfer it onto a USB or an SD? You're going to be able to do any of that with this one simple and easy system. It is so versatile. And again, standalone. So you don't need a computer for it. As soon as you plug this into the VCR, like we did here in the studio today, we're including those RCA cables to be able to do that. All of a sudden, right here on my 4.3 inch, big, bright, beautiful screen, that video pops up instantaneously and begins to play so I can see everything that's going on here. See, there's that beautiful video with the touch of that one button. All you do is press that button right there. Look at how old and that now is. you are burning this old video onto whichever you want, SD, USB, or the disc. When you're done, you simply press stop. It's gonna burn that content for you and then you have it for life. It's digital. Now you can upload on social media, email off to yeah. friends and family. It's so easy. And then let me show you the player because this is really good. So this is my husband's. I love to embarrass Ken. I don't know what yeah, my problem is. Yeah, I like one of the ones when he's really little. Is that him right it. there? No, this isn't him. Okay. Um, that's one of his cousins. And these guys are all, by the way, they're all parents now. They're yeah. all grown ups oh with gosh, children yeah. of their own. So my husband's over here in the oh, gigantic this... striped shirt. Why right. did they wear shirts so big? Not sure. <laughs> but here's the cool thing. Probably here's... a hand me down from somebody. <laughs> right? I bet I it know. was. So here's your Naxa. You're going to be able to grab an <laughs> HDMI cable that you probably already have at home. I know I have several in my house. Plug this right in to any flat screen TV, and now you can use this as a media look, player yeah, so it's in showing 1080p. Right up on the so this mirror image is being shown on the television. So this is a DVD player, a DVD recorder, an SD recorder, a USB recorder. There's your recorder. husband right there. There he is. It's his graduation from high school. Oh, you're, my God. You're welcome, honey. Oh, he was so embarrassed about this. But I'm so glad we have these memories. They were on VHS tape. The beautiful thing now is I can throw these tapes away. Yeah. I've taken all the footage that I care about that mm -hmm. I want to pass along to our little boy who's almost mm -hmm. four now, and I can throw away all of Keep these. Keep one just because it's kind of fun to have that memory. Like, this true. is where we came from. Yeah, true. That's <laughs> true. I always, you know, it's so funny. because Kids are going to be like, what's well, that? Like, Danny, no idea what it is. You know the funniest thing? You know, you and I also, <clears throat> for host pick, we always do like the Mustang turntable. Right, right. And Danny, I'll never forget when he was probably like four or five years ago when we first came out with it, he's like, what is that, a big CD? I'm like, no, it's a record. <laughs> it, it's called a record, Dan. Oh, kids he goes, dude, this looks like a big CD to me. They just don't like, know. Yeah, he sawed off they don't punk. understand our but format. But that, that's kids. That's the way they are. But <laughs> it's funny how things kind of go and people forget about what it's came true. before them. This is a way to kind of cherish and honor the memory. And um, uh, by the way, this is now, this is your husband even younger. Yes, he had two and this years is, old. This is a young Kenny who enjoys, he enjoys the wonderful world of dairy. He's exploring the finer things. So in the world he, of dairy. here's what he's doing. He's right. eating some cheese and he's washing down the cheese with milk. Yeah, yeah, This Sounds is refreshing. a child that is, loves his dairy <laughs> and he gets a lot of calcium. And look at it, he's like, this, you know what this cheese will be good in? He has really good teeth and, and bones. Does anybody have any yogurt so I can take that too? <laughs> hey, he's so funny. But I'm so glad I have this because if I had let beautiful. this footage go, I would never <laughs> forgive myself. All right. Hey, girl. Hi, guys. Danny's a cheese eater. Um, okay, there's a lot of cheese. Kurt Stone cheese. was cooking up a lot of oh, cheese, geez. so there's a lot of cheese I don't know today. what it is. Isn't that crazy? Do you love right. this thing though? I think this is really, really cool. Do you really, have any really old cool VHS tapes? Oh my gosh, I have 